the divisions between the two have deepened as one group already registered with the ECN with its own presidential candidate and a list of National Assembly candidates. The group aligned to Mike Kavekotora, who is currently the party's presidential candidate, locked the Nehova faction out of the premises in Shun Lane Street. The NBC crew was almost assaulted by a faction of Kave Kotora when they arrived at the headquarters of an event on the invitation of the party. The crew was threatened with physical assault while accusing the NBC of only being interested in news from what they called a rival faction. The bogus invitations that come from the butchers, That's what they want those, to those, those ones that you are so much interested in will not be tolerated here. We always uh, face disappointments from NBC. You people don't want to come, but you have covered a lot from outside. This time around, it is not from RDP, and it will not take place here at the RDP head office. NBC, you are full of shit. Why? One day that camera will touch the ground. Why? Because of your non- this is media. Why is this media? This is media. Why is Leave the media to defend itself. Leave the media to defend itself. Don't think that they want the men. Leave the media to defend itself. One day your cameras will touch the ground. Serious? Because of your nonsense. When we have press conference, you don't come here. Mm. You're here to disrupt this Don't organization. It has caused us the end. One day, some of you, you will touch us. You get the us. Commander, leave the media to defend themselves. Don't do that. Okay. Because of their refusal of the group who was inside the yard, Nehova's group had to hold its media briefing outside the premises. Then I eventually the law will come out and, uh, and the, the, law, the, the law will prevail. This turn of events come barely a month after one group disputing the outcome of the third convention of the party in June where Mike Kavekotora was proclaimed the winner. Following a meeting in Venthook, a faction under Mike Kavekotora held another congress in Rundu where it elected candidates for the National Assembly elections and submitted this list to ECN together with Mike Kavekotora as presidential candidate. Another faction held its congress in Oshuarongo on the 13th of this month and came up with a parallel list of candidates to parliament with Kandi Nehova as its presidential candidate. The ECN said it accepted the RDP list handed in as legitimate as it was provided by the Secretary General. However, the election of the SG was also under dispute. On inquiry as to how ECN accepted the submission of RDP candidates despite them having been alerted by RDP Director of Elections not to accept any election candidates lest they were submitted by himself as director of elections, the only official officially empowered to do so by the RDP constitution, advocate Notemba Chipwea, ECN chairperson, argued that comrade Mike Abekotora has informed ECN in writing that comrade John Shiwa Nishekwa has resigned from the position of RDP director of elections. Of course, this is completely inaccurate and false. The Nehova faction is now planning to seek agent court interdict to disqualify Kavekotora's nomination and its list of candidates. Daniel Nardunian, BC News, Venthook.